wonder what it's like to live in a home that is architectural, beautiful, and very eco-friendly? You're about to find out. Welcome to Diggs TV, this is Constance Dunn, and today we are at the first LEED Platinum Certified Home in the United States. It is the personal residence of Steve Glenn, who as founder of the company Living Homes, is someone who is known nationally for creating eco-friendly, prefabricated architectural homes. I'm Steve Glenn, I'm the Managing Director of Living Homes and the CEO of Plant Prefab, and this is the first Living Home. Welcome. Now this isn't just his house, it is a living, breathing model of RK1. It is the company's most premium and first model. Now it's designed by none other than California architectural master, Ray Cappy. Well, our model at Living Homes is to work with, with different great architects. Um, Ray's, I mean, one of my favorite all-time residential architects. He's a modernist in all the ways that you think of, at least a California modernist, so open floor plan and indoor-outdoor kind of orientation and flat roofs. Um, but unlike many modernists, he really integrates a craftsman-like attention to detail and warmth. And then we've also worked with Kieran Timberlake. They were AIA Firm of the Year once. They do incredible work. Both Ray and, and Kieran Timberlake focus on modern, extremely sustainable projects, so obviously very relevant for us. And then we, we've done um, internal design for our lower cost line, the C6 and CK line. That's all was, was designed internally. So LEED stands for Leadership in Environmental and Energy Design. It's a building certification program that was started by the nonprofit United States Green Building Agency. It's a point-based system, so you get points for things that make your buildings more energy efficient or water efficient or resource efficient or better indoor air quality, uh, points for what you do with your landscape, points for where you're located whether it's in a, a denser area, which is considered more sustainable. And based on those points, you can get certified or silver or gold or platinum. And it's really the leading green building certification program in the country, indeed the world. This home was the first certified lead platinum, um, actually in the world. To get platinum, you're having to do lots for energy, for water, for resources. You, you really can't slack in any area. Energy is the biggest place where you have points, which is appropriate because your home will use over its useful life far more energy than is embodied in the material. So the US GBC gives you the most amount of points under energy. And so there are like two parts of that. You want to create a home that's as energy efficient as possible, which has to do with your insulation and your lighting and your appliances. And then um, ultimately how you generate power, ideally through renewable resources like uh, photovoltaics or solar power. So this house is comprised of 11 modules that were installed in eight and a half hours. Yeah, 11, wow, eight and a half. That heats the hot water uh, for the radiant heating and also my domestic hot water. Um, photovoltaics here, um, so this creates power. The roof garden here and here reduces heat island effect, which is heat reflecting back into the atmosphere. Well, this, this countertop is actually made of uh, cellulose, actually newsprint. It's mixed with a bonding agent. Um, it can take up to 350 degrees. The colors throughout, so it, it, it doesn't show um, cuts as much. It's not a cutting board, but if it, it's scratched, it's, it's pretty good. 11 years and it just looks so beautiful. Yeah, the yeah, and it's done nothing to it. The floor here is concrete mixed with fly ash. Uh, fly ash is what you get when you burn coal, so normally it's landfill, so this makes it kind of a recycled content. This is cork, so the nice thing about cork is, first of all, we think it's beautiful, but yeah. it's also soft and you don't have to fell the tree to get it. The millwork here is from uh, sustainably sourced wood. It's actually Forest Stewardship Council certified wood. It's a nonprofit that certifies that wood is grown and harvested in a sustainable way. And no uh, formaldehyde or urea in the adhesives. Um, all Energy Star appliances, um, so super energy efficient appliances. The down lights are LEDs. Uh, they use a tenth of the power of incandescent and they're dimmable and there's no mercury, unlike compact fluorescent. 
Bray Water is, is using sink, shower, and bath water for irrigation. So all of the sinks actually, except the kitchen sink, which they don't allow you to use, but the bathroom sinks, the, the tub shower, the washing machine, the dishwasher, is a second pipe. And that pipe leads to a, a filter system and then it, it, it actually is uh, dispensed in the yard. So it's part of our irrigation system. This burns um, uh, ethanol, essentially. Denatured alcohol um, comes in a can. And the flame is, looks like natural gas, it's blue. It actually gives off more heat for the, its size than a fireplace, um, but there's no smoke, zero. In fact, this is solid. That's not a flu, it looks like a flu, but it's actually an equipment chase to take the radiant heating to the second floor. One of the things that we do in this, um, as an option in our homes, homes generally aren't designed to adapt to your changing lifestyle needs, so renovation, uh, is, is really expensive and stressful and wasteful in terms of resources. So we have as options uh, things like movable walls. So these walls can open and close. So when I have gas for my son, I close this off. There's more and more research showing that lead certified buildings sell for more, lease for more, have lower turnover if it's a rental. According to my water bill, I use far less water than a similar sized home, so that's because we don't have to use as much for irrigation. It's drought tolerant native landscape. My power bill averages maybe $30 a month, so that's certainly far less than a 24 500 square foot home, that's what this is. So I guess those would be two indices of, of, of sustainability. Thank you for joining us today. We of course invite you to watch other episodes of Diggs TV and subscribe to the Diggs TV channel. You can also check out Diggs Magazine at diggs.net. Farewell for now.